All right, so just follow my logic here if you're someone that's got pots. One of the things that everybody talks about all the time, venous pooling. So you get either a nick or pooling in your legs. Then that causes not enough blood return back to your heart, which causes your heart to have to beat faster to try to maintain the circulation, and then you get symptoms. But let's think about it this way. A lot of people with pots, when they put their arms over their head, they feel worse. How does that make sense? We just saw here that there's more blood flow that's being returned to the heart. So if that were the problem, then you would expect they would do better if you actually return a little bit of blood flow to the heart, because then they could push more back out in the system. What's more likely to be true, we're stealing blood. Maybe we're constricting blood flow at the subclavians, compression somewhere in the tree. But the point is that when we automatically jump to venous pooling as being the problem, and we're just gonna use compression socks and load you up with salt to be able to solve that problem, in so many of these people, it is a giant swing and a miss. We can do so much more if we get to some nuance.